My name is Ann Kamara. I've lived in Somerville for over 40 years in a grandparent's home. Um, I live in Duck Village on Hanson Street, and there was nothing there but a used car lot years ago. We've helped Somerville through diversity, violence, and now displacement. Um, my two great sons grew up here. I was in the medical field for 14 years, and for the last 31 years, I've owned a business in my home running a home daycare. Um, I taught Sunday school at St. Joe's, and the reason I taught there was to teach children to be inclusive. I'd like to see a community for everyone, not a community within a community with what US2 is building. I come from a blue-collar family, construction workers. My dad was a construction supervisor. So I understand the hard work that goes into development, but we were also homeowners that made sure that everybody was able to afford our apartments. I want to see this neighborhood council get this community benefits agreement. I would also love to see a big, wonderful, beautiful community center in Union Square. Um, in 1996, a long time ago, um, just an example of who I am, I wanted the billboards for tobacco um, taken off the, um, our corner, and I went straight to Ackerley, the billboard people. I don't mince words, I'm honest, I'm bold, I, um, I'm fair, but I, um, they took them down in our corner, the tobacco. Um, ads. And um, if I have a you know, problem in the neighborhood, we, we call the mayor's office. <laughs> um, so I imagine this council to be part of, um, to be like a melting pot of the whole neighborhood, groups, coalition, residents, businesses, and get hard work done and be inclusive. And I've also been taking grant writing classes, hoping that maybe we can do more than just, you know, the CBA. Thank you.